YouTube community. My name is Irene Mahoney and I just wanted to come on here and share with you just real quick videos on how I make some of my favorite fueling hacks. Um, so I get a lot of questions from people who want to know how I make my morning shake and I figured instead of going through my whole what I eat in a day video this way you could just watch this shake. So the first thing is I have a Nutribullet. There's a lot of different individual blenders out there, but this happens to be the one I have and I really enjoy. And one of the neat things with this is it comes with an extra large cup. Okay, so the max line is way up here. It's like, I don't know, like four cups of liquid can fit in here. So I know um, when I make the morning shake, the shake says to add one cup of water to it. And some of you are all like, your shake is way bigger than one cup. And I'm gonna tell you why. First of all, I start with one cup of ice. Okay, so I've got about one cup of ice in here. I make the coffee the night before. So this here is some iced coconut coffee that I made last night and then I just stick it in the fridge to turn it into iced coffee. And we're at about three cups according to the Mr. Coffee coffee pot here. And so I'll just pour that in until it's right under the max line. So it's about three cups on the coffee pot. Then I add one of the shakes. Today I'm gonna add the creamy vanilla shake. Um, but if you watch these videos, you know the chocolate shake, the mocha shake work beautifully. I have friends who love the caramel mochiato shake. I just don't like that one. Or the peanut butter shake. I also don't like that one in my coffee, but people do. So I'm gonna put the vanilla shake in here. Okay, the, uh, the ice crushing attachment is kind of like the aggressive looking one. I'm gonna add that. I'm gonna give it a shake. I'm gonna blend it up for like 20 seconds. So I like blend it for 10, and then I blend it for another 10 to make sure I crush up all the ice. So I'm gonna blend it, and um, I'm gonna make you listen today. Here we go. That's the first 10, and then the ice just falls back down. There we go. And it feels like all the major chunks of ice are out of it. Um, if you just give it a minute, all of the deliciousness will fall off of the blades, and you don't have to worry about missing any of your shake. There we go. And here is how I make my morning shake. Um, again, no extra condiments, no extra anything. Just how I get my coffee in the morning to be sweet and creamy without adding any creamer or adding any condiments. And I hope you found this helpful. If you did, please subscribe to my channel. Drop some comments down below. Do you uh, like to mix your shakes with your coffee or are you are you just a purist who like it just black? Let me know.